tried it, uh, so you don't have to. Talk of the town. And I was the talk of the town because Patrick pinches butts. <laughs> a butt pincher. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So for this video, we're going to be playing some more Detroit Become Human. This is part 11. One more. One more video after this one and we'll have completed the whole story. Um, I'm kind of sad to see it coming to an end, but I'm very curious to see what's going to happen. Um, don't forget to check out all the previous videos since this is a continuation of the story. Coarse language and mature subject matter warnings are in effect for this video. And I just really can't wait to see what happens next. So why don't we dive right on in and get to some Detroit Become Human. All right, November 9th, 2038. Can't believe Luther's dead. being turned over to the authorities, the country is grinding to a halt. Hospitals and schools are closing, water cuts, blackouts, and network failures are expected. Maybe most worrying of all, our armed forces have lost two-thirds of their effective personnel. How about some music instead? Okay, fine. Do I talk to you? What do I do? Let's look out the window. They've been conducting raids all over the city. Oh dear. Everybody's on edge oh. after what happened yesterday. It's gonna be all right. We're almost there. Alice well, seems okay. All right. A little further on that way, there's a large freighter called Jericho. When you get there, find Marcus. He will help you. The last bus for the border leaves at midnight. You absolutely have to be on it. We're going to meet up with Marcus. It's not much, but it's a start. My brother lives in Ontario. I've given you his Woo! address. Ontario, until things calm down. You're a very brave little girl, Alice. You deserve to be happy. Thank you for everything, Rose. Let me know when you make it over there, all right? And be careful. Okay, Jericho. Assuming this way, right? Yeah. Connor. Oh, don't tell me I have to do this whole search again. Or is he going to do it himself? So I don't want to have to do this whole search again for Jericho. I like Connor without his uniform. They're going, both going to find it at the same time. I don't know if it's safe to approach these people because I'm assuming they're like humans and not androids. Right? I don't know. The authorities have ordered all androids to be delivered to the nearest police station oh, or we found Jericho. immediately. If you are worried about your safety, dial the number on your screen and the authorities will come to collect your android. Under no circumstances should you try to destroy your 
and the neutralization of all military androids, American forces in the Arctic have been forced to withdraw, leaving the way clear for the Russian army. But according to some sources, the Russian forces also seem mysteriously to have withdrawn. Mm. The Kremlin has made no comment for the moment, but it is quite possible that the Russian army has been confronted with a similar crisis among its own androids. The chairman of the United Nations, mm -hmm. Douglas Corbel, I'm gonna find Marcus. Oh, find a warm place for Alice. That's what I'm doing. Over here, I guess. The danger of a third world war seems to have been ruled out for the moment. RA9. How do you feel? I'm hot and cold at the same time. I'll try to find this Marcus. The last bus leaves in two hours and it's on the other side of town. We'll go as soon as we have passports. Will you be okay? Well, she's gonna have to be okay. Oh, it's Lucy. And Connor. anyone's the attention. The have ordered all androids to be delivered to the nearest police station or army barracks immediately. If you are worried about your safety, dial the number on your screen and the authorities will come to collect your android. Under no circumstances should you try to destroy your android yourself. They are unpredictable and potentially violent. I don't know where I'm going, so... In here? C4. I know they're only machines, but they, they look like just people, with people who want to be free. Following the android crisis and the neutralization of all military androids, American forces in the Arctic have been forced to withdraw. Now where do I go? Do I just maybe go upstairs? Oh, Lucy. You're lost. You're looking for something. You're looking for yourself. <laughs> okay. Now where do I go? I don't know, I'm just gonna go this way. Find Marcus. Yeah, where the heck is he? The time has come for us to destroy our machines before they destroy us. Without the courage Maybe he's in there? Looks like he might be in here. We can't just let them the authorities have ordered all androids to be the There he is. Are you Marcus? I'm with a little girl. There's a bus leaving for the border in less than two hours, and we need passports. No, Detroit's under curfew. There's soldiers everywhere. They're rounding up all the androids and sending them to camps. Oh, God. Maybe you should stay here a while. Maybe you're right. You might be safer here until things calm down. One of our people used to work in the State Department. He has electronic passports you can easily modify. I'll have him get them to you. Thank you. You said you're with a little girl, right? 
You know that humans hate us. Why are you protecting her? Bond. No difference. Secret. Bond. She needs me. Then I need her. It's as simple as that. Now what? What do I do now? Return to Alice. Oh, okay. Oh my goodness. She wanted a mom. You wanted a little girl. Oh my goodness. You needed each other to survive. In the end, what difference does it make? Do you love her any less now that you know she's one of us? Maybe that's what it means to be alive. Forgetting who we are to become what someone needs us to be. She loves you. She loves you more than anything in the world. She became the one you wanted her to be. Out of love for you. That's why she doesn't eat. Ugh. What do I do? Just return to her. Okay, no, I'm returning to her. Or is that is that not her? That's just another. Oh, that's another Alice. Is is this the real? Where's the real Alice then? Wait, no, it's over here. Where's her stuff? Kara, is there something wrong? Hug, distant hug. Hello. We've gone through this together forever, won't we, Kara? This whole time. Doesn't matter. Yes. Aw, family. Forever. Marcus. We're short on blue blood and bio components. Our wounded are shutting down, and there's nothing we can do. President Warren is saying we're a threat to national security and we need to be exterminated. Humans are conducting raids in all the big cities and they're taking androids to camps to destroy them. It's a disaster. They're slaughtering our people. That's all our fault. None of this would have happened if we just stayed quiet. Aggressive, determined, righteous, somber, determined. All we did was show them who we really are. I don't want war, but I'd rather die free than live as a slave. What's the point of being free if no one is left alive? Angry, bitter, remorse, no regrets, remorse. Maybe my judgment was clouded by anger. But everything that I did was for our people. 
we shouldn't forget who our enemies are. We can't fight amongst ourselves. He's right. All that matters now is what we do next. Marcus? Confrontation, dialogue, stay hiding. Dialogue. Dialogue is the only way. Oh, North doesn't like that. Well, you know what, North? I will go alone. Try to talk to them one last time. Don't do this, Marcus. They'll kill you. Maybe. But North, I have to try. If I don't come back, lay low as long as you can. Just come back. They need to realize how much they're hurting us. Find the right words, and they'll listen. Sad, angry, thoughtful, bitter. Thoughtful. They've been butchering each other for centuries over the color of their skin or whatever god they wanted to worship. They're not going to change. Violence is just in their genes. They can't stop what we've started. Since you've been here, you've given us hope. You've given me hope. Today, a deviant arrived in Jericho and he told me that he stole a truck transporting radioactive cobalt. He said that he abandoned the truck somewhere in Detroit and rigged it to explode. I convinced him not to do it. To give me the detonator. A dirty bomb. We can't lose this war, Marcus. If humans overcome us, our people will disappear forever. This may be our only chance to survive if things go wrong. Refuse it. We shouldn't become like them, North. No. We can gain our freedom by other means. She's not gonna like that, but... I hope you're right. Whatever happens tomorrow, I just want you to know that I... I'm glad I met you. Let's touch hands again. Let's kiss. That's what humans do. Can they kiss? I'm assuming so. I'll go join the others. Look after yourself. I don't want to lose you. in locating Jericho and finding their leader. Now deal with Marcus. We need it alive. God. Stop, Marcus. Oh, great. I've been ordered to take you alive. But I won't hesitate to shoot if you give me no choice. Reason, defy, discourage, threaten. Uh, what reason. What are you doing? You're one of us. You can't betray your own people. Intimidate, instructions, instructions. You're coming with me! Convince, appeal, I know you. Convince. Appeal. We are your people. We're fighting for your freedom, too. 
You don't have to be their slave anymore. Our cause convince I know you. I know you. You're Connor, aren't you? That famous deviant hunter. Well, congratulations. You seem to have found what you were looking for. Stay back, warning shot, enough, say nothing, say nothing. So doubts question undermine. So doubts. Do you never have any doubts? You've never done something irrational? As if there's something inside you? Something more than your program. Question rally undermine. Question. Have you never wondered who you really are? Whether you're just a machine executing a program or a living being capable of reason. I think the time has come for you to ask yourself that question. It's time to decide. Uh, become a deviant. Become a deviant. He shouldn't uh, kill Marcus. What, what do I do? What's that do? Okay. They're breaking the wall. Deviant. Ooh, Amanda feels betrayed. Sorry, Amanda, get over yourself. They're going to attack Jericho. What? We have to get out of here. Shit. Oh god, oh god. Message Simon Josh helicopters blow up Jericho. Message. There are exits on the second and third floor. Find them and jump in the river. Simon and Josh. Where's Simon and Josh? I don't know. We got separated. Helicopters. They're coming from the upper deck now too. We'll be caught in the crossfire. We have to run, Marcus. There's nothing we can do. I we guess. Have to blow up, blow up Jericho. If the ship goes down. They'll evacuate. Now people can escape. You'll never make it. The explosives are all the way down in the hold. There are soldiers everywhere. She's right. They know who you are. They'll do anything to get you. Go and help the others. I'll join you later. Marcus! I won't be long. Oh, God. This is terrifying. Oh, uh, Lucy. Not Lucy!
Open the door. Android dead? Because if so, that was a waste. Oh god, this is so stressful. <laughs> I don't want any of these people to die. Way to go. Okay, cop copper's there. Gamma squad out. Turn go. Oh shoot. Stop. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Look out! There they come! Don't move! We surrender! We surrender! Don't shoot! <sighs> Can I intervene? Rip off. Marcus! It's Marcus! Go now! Join the others! Surrender. Play dead. Defend Alice. Don't move. Wait a minute! I don't want to. I don't want to. Oh my gosh, I'm getting emotional. This is intense. <sighs> Quick, we gotta go. K 
Okay, I think Kara and Alice are out. Save North. I can't shoot. Shoot. And there you have it. Oh my goodness. That revelation about Alice literally shocked the heck out of me. I wasn't seeing it coming. I don't know why, but I honestly didn't see that coming. I was like, what? Are you serious right now? And that whole exiting Jericho intense scene was so stressful to me. It was like bringing out emotions, but then high intensity and like letter bashing and keyboard bashing. I'm sure you could hear it all in the clicking that I was doing, but uh, that was intense. And honestly, I can't wait to find out what happens next. And I hope you guys are too. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. We'll see you in the next one. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>